Confident Computing number 803. Why don't I get sound from my computer? A checklist. So with all this mass migration to online uh, meetings, video conferencing, even Skype calls and such, uh, the number of people that are having or experiencing problems with their sound is increasing. This is an article that I'm featuring this week that's actually a checklist of the most common problems that you might experience when you're actually having problems with your sound cards, the most, the most common reasons. Also this week, you know, Backing up to an internal drive is one of those things that sounds kind of weird. If you've got a second internal drive in your machine, why would you back up to it? Well, as it turns out, while there are alternatives that might be better, it's actually not as crazy as you might think. Edge uses Bing as its search engine. That's no real surprise. They both come from Microsoft. Microsoft would be silly to have a different default search engine. They do make it a little difficult to understand exactly how to change the search engine, though, and we've got an article on that this week for both the old and the new versions of uh, Microsoft Edge. And finally, uh, for this week's articles, you know, signing in with a PIN, it is so convenient. I do it all the time myself, but is it really as secure as signing in with a password? Well, there are scenarios where it's actually more secure. This week on the TEH podcast, Gary and I had a guest, Kay Savitz, former guest or former host of the TEH podcast, joined us for an hour or so of commentary on random things, including why we're Zooming rather than Skyping, and is the Internet Archive violating copyright? This week's live webinars, I did two of them this week. Customizing Windows 10, I did last Wednesday. That's an interesting one that'll show you some of the things that I do to Windows 10 whenever I set a new copy up. And then uh, Saturday, I talked about installing Edge and LastPass and actually walked through some of the scenarios where a LastPass will fill in, how to save new LastPass entries, and what to do if you've got multiple accounts on the same uh, website. Anyway, both of those are available online right now. I've actually decided to scale back the number of live webinars I'm going to do each week. Right now, the tentative plan is every Saturday at 2 p.m. Pacific time. I hope this finds you well. I hope you're surviving and I hope you stay healthy. Take care, everyone. Again, this is Confident Computing number 803. Why don't I get sound for my computer?